crisis, they stand a good chance really of winning. Well, his legacy is all tied into the Iraq war because in the Iraq war we've lost lives and money and honor and a, lie ba a, lie, a law based on misinformation. If it had in fact been imminent threat, as we were told, an Al-Qaeda connection and weapons of mass destruction, that would have been a war with some moral footing, some moral foundation. But he in fact uh, chose uh, corrupted Iraqi exiles over UN inspectors. He in fact left uh, pursuing the Taliban and bin Laden who did hit us pursuing Iraq, which did not hit us. And that is a, remains a big question. And people ask it usually by saying it had to be about the oil and not about democracy. There is no honor in this war. It's Bush. I think he's a very bright guy. I mean, he and, he and Clinton had formed a great coalition. I think he had some sense of social justice. He has a, a world view, but somehow got sucked into the Iraq war. Uh, and that war is a is a sinking hole. And this point, we are unfortunately we are in a hole, looking for a shovel, not for a rope. We're not looking for a way to come out. Most nations are pulled out, except the U.S. seems to be caught in the in the quicksands of Iraq and can't get out. When we're written by the people, you fight a war, you at least to have the support of the people for whom you're fighting. Uh, we do not have the support of the people in Iraq, nor in fact of the government, so it is there. It's propped up by U.S. troops, and on, on the backs of U.S. troops are targets. And so we've lost nearly 4,000 lives in, in four years, and the numbers are rising, but peace does not appear on, to be on the, on the horizon. And I'm concerned, of course, that our own penchant toward violence, and within, we've lost over 4,000 uh, Americans in Iraq in four years. We've lost, we lose 30,000 a year to gun violence. 30,000 a year are killed at home because we, we, we made weapons of mass destruction legal. So we stopped the flow in Iraq and we supplied the flow in, uh, in Iraq. I mean, can you imagine 30,000 Americans killed a year because of gun violence, another 100,000 injured? This idea of violence must really be destroyed. Thank you very much.